double yen. Welcome to today's attempt at the double double puzzle. Each tile at the bottom could stand for either of the two letters that's on it. So for example, if I typed spare, that's how it would come across. But this could also spell glare. And even if that first letter does go green, I won't actually know if it's the G or the S that's meant to go there. As it happens, we don't have a G or an S, so that simplifies things a bit. But we definitely have an A or an O, and we've got an E or an N. And of course, either of those tiles, or both of them, might be duplicated. So, what is a sensible thing to do next? I suppose blank A, blank E, blank is a likely pattern. So let's try caked. Right, we get the AO in the right place, but not the EM. I don't think it's going to be AE or OE, so that makes it more likely, I think, that there's an M rather than an E and that it's in first. Let's try mocha. No. Well, the C and V are not going to be last, are they? I suppose it could be an IC ending. M O blank I C? Not completely convinced by that. But it can't be a C E ending either. Um, M A. What would come after a C? I suppose it could be a C T ending? M O blank C blank. Or M O blank V blank. Because it can't even be mauve. I keep saying M-O, but it obviously could be M-A. But I mean, it can't be match either. M-A blank C blank. What would that last letter be? C-V is just such an unlikely title to come full for fifth, especially given that there's not an E in fifth. So it's not a C-E or a V-E ending. Um, so what do I think instead? Manic. It is just going to be an IC ending, isn't it? I don't know why I didn't think of that earlier. But there we go. It could have been Monic as well. Um, don't know what that word means. I know Monica, but not Monic. Anyway, that's double double. Let me know if you were shouting manically at the screen. Thank you for watching, and bye for now.